Hello guys, this is Let's Talk Football and today I'm going to talk about my championship predictions. Um including a little bit about Crystal Palace, um I'm gonna talk about Yeovil and finally about the weekend's fixtures. So the current top six stand in the championship as Cardiff, Crystal Palace, Middlesbrough, Leicester, Millwall and Hull. And down the bottom it is Bristol City, Sheffield Wednesday and Peterborough United. First of all, my top six predictions. I'm going to go for Cardiff to finally break out the championship and win the league. I've got Ian Holloway's Crystal Palace to come second, and because they're my like, if I want a team to go up in the championship, it would be Crystal Palace. Um, third, I think would be Middlesbrough or Leicester or something like that. Uh, and then I think Blackburn will pull it back and not one Forest. I think that's five and I think Hull will as well get into the playoffs. Uh, in the playoffs I think probably Middlesbrough or Blackburn will win the playoffs if they get in there. And the bottom three, I'm going to stick with the bottom three at the moment with Bristol City, Sheffield Wednesday and Peterborough because that is what I actually think will happen. But um, just going on about Crystal Palace, they've obviously just recently bring in Ian Holloway. Obviously Ian Holloway started manager after Dougie Freeman left for Bolton after Owen Coyle was I think sacked. Yeah he was sacked and um he started off with a great 5-0 win against Mid McCarthy Zips which he recently took over as well but they they look like a bit of a dead cause at the moment as well. Maybe it maybe Ipswich might go down maybe instead of Bristol. Um that he started off and then secondly he um, beat Ferguson's um, team Peterborough 2-1 then a uh, 3-0 route over Derby at Selhurst Park then they lost 2-1 at Ellen Road against Leeds which I was a bit shocked about as Leeds aren't doing very well but they've just got a takeover now which is very good for them and finally last oh, Tuesday they drew 0-0 with Hull City it was a toss-up between two players for their key player, but I've gone with Wilfred Saha. Obviously, Glenn Murray's been playing very well this season, scoring, you know, a lot of goals for them. But I've just chose Wilfred Zaha because he's been. Very, this has probably been his best season, and I think he's going to thrive under Ian Holloway. And he also got picked for the England squad against Sweden. But Ibra just scored that absolutely amazing bicycle kick. But yeah, that, the guy you can see on the screen, I think, is their best player and will go on to be some player in a few years time maybe playing for a top 4 Premier League team in the video I'm going to do the championship fixtures the first championship um, <laughs> Premier League uh, fixtures so first of all it's West Ham vs Chelsea um, I think West Ham will draw that game with Chelsea they're on a good run of form kind of been doing well in the Premier League Arsenal will be Swansea. Uh, I think Arsenal will win. It's at the Emirates. Uh, Fulham will be Tottenham. That will be a very good game, actually. Uh, I think that will be a one-all draw. With Liverpool versus Southampton. Well, Southampton have been doing all right at the moment, actually. Picked up seven points from the last three games, I think. Liverpool, you know, they're doing all right as well. Lots of draws, though. But if Luis Suarez turns up, they should win that game. Man City, Everton which is a good game but I think City will win only because they have the home advantage QPR Villa which is a huge game at the bottom of the league I think Q uh, yeah Harry Redknapp will win his, far, his second game in charge of Aston uh, QPR after his 0-0 draw at Sunderland uh, West Brom vs Stoke I think that will be West Brom now obviously in top football Stoke they got the win on Wednesday but you know, nothing brilliant this season. And finally, Reading versus Manchester United, where I think Manchester United will come out 2 0 winners. Um, so obviously, this FA Cup this week, so there'll be no Football League show. Um, you know, my Football League show, not the one on BBC One. And, but there will be a Premier League video going up on Sunday after the Norwich v Sunderland game, where I think Sunderland will win 1 0. Alright, guys, cheers for watching, and I'll catch you all later.